Did you know today is National Ditch Your Resolutions Day? We are only 17, oh, it's my cousin Gina's birthday. Thank oh. you for reminding me. 17 days into the new year. Why are we already failing? Kara's here with all of the answers and things to care about. Hi. Oftentimes I want to do something that makes us feel better about ourselves and Oftentimes, too, it is not our fault that we abandon resolutions right. or we don't follow through on things. It's science, and I'm here to give you the science behind it. Okay, did you make resolutions this year or goals or? I did. Well, I mean, it was just sort of to um, lose the baby weight, just to keep things moving forward. Okay. But you know what I thought? If I didn't have this job to come to every day, I don't want to lose my job, but I'm saying if I didn't have this job to come to every day, I wouldn't care as much that I don't fit into any of my clothes, but this job is motivating me because I need clothes to to wear to, to wear my right. job. And I think every single mm -hmm. mother out there remembers that feeling. I think yeah. I told you I had Kate in January right. and none of my clothes were fitting. Sure. So literally on this show, nine years ago, there I was wearing like summer dresses with like a sweater on. And yeah, it's hard. Because it was like, and they were like moo moos, right. the only thing that would fit me. So anyway, it's. Yes. Um, listen, it, take your time. Hard. You look fabulous. Thanks. I People really, tell me all the time, tell oh, Kara she looks fabulous. Thank you very much. It's I very mean, nice. Like, okay, I get yeah. it. I didn't write mm -hmm. goals down, but okay. I really want to meditate more, and I have not started that yet. So okay. I, I, you could say <laughs> I haven't even abandoned it because <laughs> right. I haven't started it, but I'm, I really, really, really want to. I think mm -hmm. it will help my psyche. Sure. It will help me because I'm very intense yeah. sometimes. I well, think it will be nice. I It'll too. just take a beat and take a moment. Yeah. Reflect on you. I would like for hurt. anybody watching who is really good at meditating, mm -hmm. um, it, but you know, obviously, you know, you start off slowly. You got to build up. Right. Tell me how you did. What what you know? If there was a book or if there's a sure an app, um, an, app an app for yes. that. Anyway. Okay, all right, Tell let's me. get into, um, well, this is interesting. So, U.S. News and World Report say 80% of people give up their resolutions by this, not th today, but the second week in February, okay? That's sad. So, although I did read something else that said we usually spend the first three months of the year trying to better ourselves, trying to stick to our resolutions, so roughly we spend about 10 years of our lives trying to better ourselves. So take that too wow. for what it's worth. But um, a recent Forbes article um, outlines the top reasons we fail to achieve these goals in such a short <laughs> amount of time. Tell so me. maybe you can, we have one minute left. Maybe you no. can, oh, oh, four, no. <laughs> oh, I was like one minute left. No, oh no, my gosh, four, I gotta Kara, help the four. people. Yes. Okay, <laughs> now the first one is we aren't picking realistic goals. All right, so most everyone wants to lose weight like we just talked about. You wanna eat healthy, those are very popular ones, but ask yourself what's attainable. So if you have a significant amount to lose, like say you want to lose 100 pounds, or do you just want to like cut refined sugar, or maybe you want to take a drink, a, drink more water every day. Right. So just try to maybe take smaller steps that will form a habit and thus then improve and you'll stick to your resolution that way. Right, we talk about easier. that all the time, mm -hmm. yeah. I mean, don't bite off more you, more than you can chew because then you um, you really feel so deflated and like you've let yourself down when right. when you've abandoned these goals because they are just too lofty. Yeah. I like yeah. that, baby yes. steps. Yes, baby steps. Mm -hmm. Okay, so also we fail to make things a habit, so we fail to make whatever we want to change an actual habit. Um, if your resolution mm. is to stop a bad habit, you need to replace it with a good one that serves the same purpose. So you should also intentionally avoid things Things that will trigger bad behavior. This one was interesting to me because I really feel too like with the um, wanting to lose a few pounds, it's like flipping the mindset because right. normally if I feel like I'm at a healthy weight for me um, and I work out, it gives me like a license to, like this is just my mindset, a license to like, you know, have another drink or eat whatever I want, like, cause I worked out. Right. But now I'm having to think, okay, I worked out to like keep that, whatever I just burned, I have to keep it yes, off. So I, I still have to like stick to eating well too. It's really hard. I know it is, it is. But again, it's, hard, yeah. it's a small steps. Yeah. Right, mm -hmm. okay. Don't stress out. Okay, um, the next one, I like this one. We don't have support. Ask your partner to make breakfast for the kids while you go into <laughs> like a class every Saturday morning that you want to. Um, I love or that. start an accountability group, text with a few friends. That's good, the more the merrier. Um, don't be afraid to reach out and ask for what you need. Yes. Mm -hmm. I like that. Um, you know, Jim has been very good about res eating right. Yeah. I mean, starting the new year off on a great, great foot. I'm 
that's my job. Oh, yeah, what? Kind of, yeah, no, he's been getting up extra early. He's oh, been good. making us all breakfast. Oh, that's so My nice. mom has been loving it. He's been making us egg white omelets. Oh, I mean, nice. who does that? Send him up. Yeah. I know. It's It's been good. He's, that's great. You would think I would be a little more motivated. I'm just trying to make right. it get through the day. Well, that's nice. He's making you breakfast. Yes. To start your own mm -hmm. breakfast. I exactly. just ordered a bunch of... Um, all mason jars because I saw on Pinterest all these great overnight oat recipes. Oh, so tell I'm me gonna how that stock goes. our fridge with these Good. Um, overnight oats. Yeah, overnight oats, and I'm sure we'll stick to it for about a week, and then everybody will forget. No, don't say that. Okay. Okay. Number four. All right, we fail to track our goals. Keep it simple and track things such as your daily food, if that's something you want to do, um, monthly measurements, and weekly weight. Because by having a visual representation of your results, no matter what it is, you you start meditating, you see yourself being more relaxed, yes. make a note of it because once we start to see changes in our attitude and our body if that's our thing then um, you will feel better yes and, and you're more likely to stick to it absolutely I love mm -hmm. those thank you let okay. us know how you're doing guys mm -hmm. we want to hear from you we want to be inspired yeah. by you go to our Facebook page uh, facebook.com slash ATL and co yeah. please let us know people are saying it's what an are intention this year we're, we're oh. setting intentions this year we're not New year, new you, new you isn't a thing because that puts too much pressure on us. Right. So we're just setting intentions. Setting intentions. I, I love know. that. Just do whatever you want.